From Paris to Tokyo, Berlin, Chicago, and Detroit, a local mom has literally run all over the world. And right now, she's gearing up to run one of her favorite half marathons, the OUC Orlando Half, on December 2nd. But even with all of those miles under her belt, this race could be one of her most challenging yet. Mm -hmm. And that is because this year, she now has three kids under three, Yikes. having had twins <laughs> just mere months ago. I met up with super mom Gabrielle Russen to find out how she is getting ready for race day. I've been running since my 20s. I fell in love with it the first 5K I did, and I've, I've been running ever since. So these are my these are my marathon medals. These are my half and 5K medals. Yeah. I'm not sure how many halves I've done. I've done 25 fulls. This is probably my favorite my favorite uh, race. I did Berlin Marathon in 2019, and my husband proposed to me. Uh, during the race. He was cheering for me on the sideline and you know as, as I run by him he grabs my hand and, <laughs> and kneel down and I was like what's happening? Uh, yeah but it was I it, it was I was so surprised. Learned. I have a, a two-year-old son and in June I gave birth to twin girls Rosalind and Brooklyn and my son is Boomer. <laughs> I had a C-section June 22nd. I needed to wait till I got the okay from my doctor. Uh, and then in August, you know, I started out very slowly, walking a mile, and then move a little faster, then go two miles, running and walking. I did a 5K in August with one of the track track races. And I'm now I'm running five miles. I have to get about 5 a.m. while everyone's sleeping and go run around Lake Yola. That's how I'm doing it. Winner set! do the OUC half every year because it's a local race and it's just, you know, doing a hometown race. You have to do it every year. Good morning. Have a great run. Thank you. You know, it's just a celebration. Everyone cheering you on and you feel good about the community being out there. It's kind of my comeback race. So I'm, that's really exciting to me, but it's also running is really important. I'm a freelance writer. I have three kids. You know, it's a lot of stress. It's a lot to juggle. And when I run, I feel free. I have, I feel centered. It brings me joy. It's my me time. It's just really special. They're hard miles and then they're easy miles and fun miles and you just take it all in stride. You know, relax and enjoy every mile, even the hard ones. I get chills thinking about it. It's gonna be really emotional thinking of the finish line and how much it means to me and how I went from having a C-section and you know not feeling so great and worrying I'd never be able to run again and then just taking it really slowly and, and kind of getting my mojo back. And I think, you know, and I think about what running, running means to my family. I want my kids to know to be healthy and active. So there, and I hope they'll be there when I'm crossing the finish line. <laughs> Guys, Gabby is amazing. She is also training for a full marathon in London in wow. April. You can run with Gabby and Team Wesh on December 2nd here in Orlando, though. Registration is still open for both the half marathon and the 5K. The registration link is on our website, wesh.com. Just click the OUC half marathon tab. And in case you haven't heard, Stuart Sheldon and I will be out there running the half. I think Sonica's running the 5K. I'll have to double check that with her, but that's what I've been told. And of course, Wesh is going to carry the race for you live that morning. So if you are not running, we hope you are watching and maybe you'll run next year.